arrived. Time to collect the Evo. Sick. <laughs> she's just open? Oh, this is the key here. Oh, thank you, sir. There it goes. Thank you. There you go, there you go. Here we go. What is it? It's a shitty, uh... That's a shit box for sure. Shit box. And this is a... GTR. Shit box, GTR. This is a... This is what I exactly didn't want to do, right? That's exactly what you didn't want to do. And fortunately, right now, you're not doing it. Hey, I'm Albo. I came to Japan as an English teacher, then moved near Tokyo to pursue my passions. I became a filmmaker because I love cars, Japanese culture, and a good story. I'm lucky enough to live the JDM dream. And so my videos are about my car life in Japan, where I go to car meets and visit shops, do track days and toge runs, build and review cars, and shoot vlogs, short films, and documentaries about Japan's car culture and history. Join me and my friends on our adventures and find out what it's really like in the land of the rising sun. So hop in, fasten your seatbelts, and enjoy the ride. I will need an oil change before we go to Toga. Yeah, so. the Subi seems to be burning oil a bit. So I got some some good oil from our good friend, oily boy, Julian, French dude. <laughs> he works at a, a Japanese beauty company. So like like one of the major, you know, like, like beauty pharmaceutical companies. And he gets access to all these facilities to just make oil for us. So he always makes all of our oil. Whoa, that's sick. It's super cool. It's so, actually super cool. He's like a oil genius. And you're gonna get it done at Autobox. Yes. That's yes. cool. I've never been to a normal auto box. I've been to the super auto box, which is like the, wow, right. like the crazy one. So yeah. like, is this like comparable to like your advanced auto parts or something? Exactly. Yeah. yeah, cool. Like a pet boys or something. Can't believe you guys have gritty like trans oil and like Crisco. That's wild, dude. We got the good shit. You guys got the good stuff. In Japan, you can get a smell that smells female smell. The musk, right? This is musk. Yes, so white, white musk. musk. Yeah, yeah, this one smells good. I like it. Do you should like it? Yeah, I like it. I should give this to Masa, so then it's like, when he smells it, he, he thinks he's got a girlfriend in the car. <laughs> so every time he's like... I love you, buddy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> JD fuckboy smell. So check it out, they've got some pretty cool stickers here at Autobox. I like this one. Yeah. Just, you know, drive safe. Yeah. And then this one is pretty cool too. So... This says Osaki ni dozo, and that means kind of like going ahead, like I'm not trying to race you, so you can just go ahead and pass me. So Yushi and Dustin are gonna go to Yamadenki because Dustin wants to pick up a new GoPro, and I'm gonna wait for Julian so we can do the oil change on the Forester. So let's just watch the DB8 roll away. This thing is super cool. I mean, four wheel drive, I mean, it's not four wheel drive, four door Integra Type R. While Abo gets his oil chain, I'm taking a quick trip with my new friend Yoshi here. Hello. And we're actually picking up a new GoPro because my GoPro sucks and we're gonna have a lot of drives tonight. We'll get an in-depth look at this later, but this is Yoshi's actual Integra Type R. So freaking cool. We're gonna run down later, right? Yeah, we'll, we'll, <laughs> we'll have fun later, yes. man. <laughs> so let's go find a GoPro. So Julian's here. Hey Julian. Hey. And he's uh hooked this up with some oil. Julian is the oil master. He makes the oil himself. And what, what filter are we gonna use? <laughs> PIA Twin Power. Oh yeah, the good stuff. Dustin's back. GoPro, good to go. Got nice. It is so nice. Yeah. 
Oh, I love that shoe. This is the hot one. Finally made it to the cafe. Gonna get a little bit of work done before bit, bit, we have bit, a long night ahead. Hit it one scene. And it, yeah, right? That's how it's gonna go. It's like a traditional Japanese cafe, right? Yeah, this this one is called Komeda Coffee and it's it's a it was started in Nagoya, mm -hmm. so like a little bit of western <laughs> Japan. It is. No, no, I know. I was thinking you know about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Made I know, me laugh so I know much. these details. Dude, I come here like every day. <laughs> well, there's one across the street from my place and I, I always edit here. So the thing that's really good here, there's two things. There's this cream soda with like a little shoe over oh, there, like a cream soda float. Yeah. The other one is, I don't know how hungry you are, dude, because you guys miso know. katsu. Yeah. Katsu's my favorite. Dude, I'm not hungry at so all. So good, dude. <laughs> I'm in the mood for something cold, though. Like if we get like ice, ice cream. cream. All right, so having a quick snack. It's like super hot today. So while my car is getting an oil change, we decided to stop by at the local Pomeda Coffee. Me and Dustin are just editing videos so we can get these out like on a daily basis. It's pretty tough, but you know, it's all, all part of the YouTube grind. Cream soda has arrived. Here we go. Basically a melon soda float. All right, so me and Yushi are gonna go pick up my car because I finally got my oil changed. And we, we are now ready to do some illegal street racing tonight. I'm just joking. We're just gonna go for a nice, chill, quiet drive, right, Yushi? Yeah, very chill. Chill, quiet, very chill. Yes. You know what, this is like a, the old version of the new Civic. Hey, thanks Yushi for the drive. Thanks. And we got the Forester back. And hopefully, should be all right. We got some extra oil, like, left over. So we are here at Yakinuku King, our favorite franchise for Korean barbecue. See, we call it Korean barbecue so we're, because we're in Japan. Anyways, we're at Yakiniku and Earlier today, after I got my oil change, I took a peek in the engine bay and I realized that my alternator belt is close to snapping. So I have to get the replaced. It just hasn't been replaced. And it looks like it's on the verge of snapping. You can see over here, that's actually part of the alternator belt. So plan is right now, maybe leave this at Julian's place. Maybe tomorrow I can take it to uh, Subaru. And then Yushi has another car, which is an evil wagon. We will go pick that up. Then maybe I'll just drive that around for a while. Crazy day. It's kind of like our, uh, our tailgate pregame. It's not the Eat up, eat up. Hello. Japanese beef always the diverse. You gotta, you gotta right. choose. No more cola for the rest of your life. Or no more purchasing another shit box for the rest of your life. You can't even inherit them. You will choose the shit box. my life, life work. <laughs> your life work? No shit box, no life. Make yeah. Man. No shit box, no life. <laughs> Make a t-shirt. Yeah, I need shit box in my life. Alright guys, we're just getting some gas before another night of adventures. I love how Chase is bringing back the underglow. All right, let's continue on our adventure. Now his driving gloves. Not gonna drive fast, not gonna go into VTEC. I'm not gonna go into VTEC, but I'm still gonna drive. As well as I wanna keep the, I can try and nice. Um, this was, um, I bought it at um, Harry's shop. Oh, nice. Yeah, so it's really cool. Sick. This is so sick. 
I did no BD but fully BD. Alright, we are at our favorite spot. Let's just chill here for a bit. Oftentimes this place is pretty hot. Today looks like we got a pretty good turnout. Toge culture. Toge. That's pretty sick, right? Yeah, that's a super good. Ride. That was good. This is where people blast up and down. So. We're thinking it's a bit risky tonight. Yeah. yeah. What are we doing? Cruise. A cruise. Yeah. Just a cruise. Okay. I like cruise. Like 40K. Yeah. What made you change your mind? I mean, come on. <laughs> I was waiting for this. <laughs> Just going slow. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay. No VTEC. You should have seen it was the funniest thing ever when we passed the van. Um, <laughs> he was like, I'm sorry, car. One more time. <laughs> Just one more time. Last one more time. <laughs> it's like, last round. I see the smoke coming out. I'm like, oh, yeah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Oh god, this is really bad situation. I don't know. Oh no. This is bad. What happens if we're not gonna go fast, right? I mean, if he's down his lane, they, they'll pass. Yeah, I'll let them pass. Let's go! Everybody just go, not me! <laughs> Why, guys? <laughs> go, you idiots! What? <laughs> this is what I exactly didn't want to do! <laughs> <laughs> guys! <laughs> This is what I didn't want to do, okay? Oh, it's so funny. There you go, there you go. There we go. What is it? It's a shitty, uh... Oh, that's a shit box for sure. Shit box. And this is a... Uh, GTR. GTR. Shit box GTR. This is a... Uh, this is what I exactly didn't want to do, right? That's exactly what you didn't want to do. Unfortunately, right now you're not doing it. That was fucking that was fun. Sick. That was, that was a blast. Okay. Yeah. That was... All right, let's keep going. This car is so fast on the downhill, man. Yeah, you're pulling away. This car is amazing. Front wheel drive is so fun. Okay, we've arrived. Time to collect the Evo. Sick. <laughs> it's just open? Oh, there's the key here. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. So, this is my car now, right? Yes. 
Captain <laughs> Rifle Rules will be yours permanently. Now I'm in the evil wagon. Let me drive this for a bit. It's an automatic, but I'll give you guys my thoughts after we get back to the Airbnb. Okay, you can barely see it, but we have arrived at our toge, little toge house over here. This is uh, quite possibly the sickest Airbnb of all time. <laughs> right I beside love, the toge. I love like in the air yeah. or in like just ambient noise. His car's drifting, Yeah. but also just like absolute quietness. It's amazing. You can hear the cicadas. Well, yeah, this is uh, this is the spot. This is our Airbnb. I know it's super freaking dark, but oh, oh. do you hear? It? Yeah. That That's so sick. <laughs> <laughs> goosebumps, dude. Yeah. Instant goosebumps right yep. now. Yeah. Yeah. So let's go figure out how to unlock it. All right. It's oh all night. <laughs> The fuck? Ah! The, God, dude, the bugs are insane here. Whoa. Dude, this place is amazing. This is awesome. This is like the best Airbnb yet. Oh, there's an too. Wow. Look at this place. What's in here? It's like a living room? Oh, it's a, it's a bedroom. Bunk baits. Bunk baits. Let's go check out upstairs. Look at the design of this place. There's probably like four more rooms upstairs. Double bed, bedroom, double bed, bedroom. Wow. Whoa, look at this. Wow, nice. You can even get the Japanese experience in this room. Nice and creepy. Wow, sick. This is great. 
while we were just editing our videos, we could hear cars just driving around outside, really close by, just kind of like down the street, or maybe somewhere in the valley. But we are literally in this Airbnb in the middle of like the Hakone Toge. So let's just go outside and see what we can find. It's a bit chilly, huh? We have the evil wagon. Yuji has graciously lent me his evil wagon so we can enjoy some toge action while my forcer is slightly out of commission. Guys, so we are now here at Moto Hakone, right beside Hakone Shrine. You can see Hakone Shrine right behind me. Longtime viewers of the channel will recognize this as the spot where I met one of my friends. Well, met her again, Aoi, and she was in the really, really popular video how I met a girl street racer here on the Toge. And uh, right now, looks like there's nobody here because it's like 2 a.m. But I think I've got an inkling of one of the toges where they actually do street drifting. I've never actually seen street drifting here at Hakone, but maybe we can see it if we go down one of the toges down there. Another thing I want to mention is the evil wagon is freaking amazing. Like this thing is so sharp in corners, and even though it's an automatic, once you put it into manual mode, and you can use the Tiptronic shifter, it's incredible. Like, Alvin and I were just talking and I'm so damn grateful that like we get to do this, you know? Like we were just sitting here, it's three o'clock in the morning, we're at 7-Eleven in the middle of Hakone in Japan. Beside Hakone Shrine, just, uh, beside the huge Toge. With my R34 GTI, just like, damn dude. This is like, this is amazing. It's really thankful. We were like sitting here pondering for like 30 minutes. And it's you guys who are watching these videos exactly. that make this all possible for us. So yes. huge thanks Thank to you. you guys. Thank all of you. Without you, none of this would ever be possible. And I hope you guys have been enjoying the, the videos. You know, we've been doing this for a while. Um, we're enthusiasts ourselves. We kind of know or have an idea of what like wanna around see, the world yeah. want to see. And so you're kind of like trying to see it through their eyes. Like what kind of shots, what kind of scenes would they like to see? Exactly. And then when it all comes together in a video, you're like, the moral of the story, guys, is enjoy your car. So you, you know what's awesome? Like either chasing you or seeing the car in the rearview mirror. Yeah. Like the whole scene feels like a scene from Initial D. <laughs> it's crazy. Every time we're on Toge, I'm like, oh, this is, this is it. This is it. This is we're it. living it. Yeah. <laughs> Saying, dude. Just Japan. So like, just scene. Japan, oh dude. <laughs> 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 Amazing. Amazing night, dude.